Hey, this is Monkey Boy with Monkey View Films with my first app review for my iPad 2. This is, it's named Flash for i Flash on iPad because it pretty much is Flash. Uh, but uh, it's called Splash Top Remote Desktop for iPad, as you can see. It costs about 2 bucks and is about 3.8 megabytes. But um, it's, it's like Log Me In, but like that's 30 bucks. But it's a lot better and a lot cheaper, in my opinion. See, it says right here, you can play World of Warcraft. Um, he, I guess he's on iTunes. He's playing Plants vs. Zombies. I don't see how that's fun. And he's in that one. I don't really know what he's doing. But, yeah. All you have to do, really, is it's it's it works like work, log me in. All you do is just download the app, make an account on the website, and download the software. And, uh, yeah. So what I did, I downloaded it on my iPad, and um, hopefully it won't say uh, there's my IP. Um, but anyway, yeah, it's, it's, it shows up there, my laptop, user PC, and um, I don't, oh yeah, user PC is my laptop, but I'm, I custom made one, but it's a little faster, but yeah. Well, so once you get it all set up, you just go and just touch your computer. The laptop will kind of refresh into a diff. A, it says right there, iPad is controlling this computer. It, it will go into lower resolution. It will come up with this all these hints on what to do and stuff. So yeah, it's not that laggy as you would expect. But let's see. I was just watching some a South Park video, or like a full episode. You can watch it at SouthParkStudios.com if you didn't know, but that's what I did. Oh, thank God there's not an ad, but I'll probably just jinx myself. Oh, okay, I didn't, but yeah. I would suggest having it as low quality as possible, or like I was watching YouTube at... 360p and it was it was it was okay it was pretty good. Yeah, and actually the sound from the computer. Yeah, it's it's muted up there. So yeah, it's kind of it's it's running pretty smooth. Because in log me in, it doesn't it lags all the time. You can't do anything. Um, oh, I almost just closed, but I'm going, I'm not going to, I'm not going to think that it's going to work like Team Fortress, Portal, and all that, but I'm just going to try something that's in the basic games folder, because I don't really have any of those, but yeah, see, I'm scrolling, it's pretty smooth, um, there's games. Yeah, you can also pinch to zoom. Oh yeah, if you hold it down, it'll do. It'll like right click. Okay. Ink ball. Hmm. That's actually kind of decent. Um. Okay, it kind of just went in by itself. But, hmm. It's not that bad, but I can I can imagine that it will lag out of its mind on World of Warcraft by like this. Okay. Um, I don't really know any Flash games, but I could look up, like, ah, uh, on, I guess, addicting games. Oh, yeah, there's also a little keyboard thing right there. You can bring, and bring up the keyboard at any time. Uh, okay, addicting games. Search. I have never gotten on this website since I was like in fifth grade, but 
I'm not sure when this app came out, but wait, I can check, but, like, it'll log me out. Um... Um... I don't care. It's just American Truck 2. Well, I'm basically making this video because I want to get the word out because this is actually this is like a really good app. I don't know when this came out, but skip. Hmm. Not looking bad so far. Play. Um. Where would be the arrow keys? Oh, right there. Okay, and spacebar to break. Let's probably scroll. Ah. It's a little bad. And start. Hmm. Yeah, we're trying to push the arrow keys on here. Huh. Well, I um, I know that log me in has has arrow keys like built in, but what's that? What did that do? Um, I don't know. Well, I give up on that. <laughs> but yeah, I can't find arrow keys. So you can't play games that have arrow keys, I guess. Because that, this just doesn't work, seems. Or maybe if I click in here. Ah. Ah. Okay, well, yeah, it's only two bucks, and it recommends that you have a good computer. Oh, yeah, it, yeah, it's pretty. I I recommend it more, definitely more than Ignition. Or log me in. I mean, um, watch a YouTube video randomly. This is not my video. Machinima. See, it's not that bad. Really at all. Hi, Machinima. This is Foreplay, and this is the fourth installment of Foreplay's Travels. With me is Trick, and my main man, Raj, as always. Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's pretty smooth. I'm on 360p. Okay. Well, I should probably wrap, wrap this up a bit, I guess. But, okay, well, this has been it for this app. I'm going to go ahead and go back to the app store so you can see it. Splash Top Remote Desktop. See, I just signed me out. Splash Top Remote Desktop for iPad. Oh, right here. This came out May 13th. So, or updated, it says. I don't know when it came out. But there's already like 1,069 ratings. Well, I'm just going to go ahead and end this. If you, for more iPad videos, Xbox, lap, I don't know, anything related like that. So, yeah, subscribe. And thanks.